Today I'm going to show you how to bleed the air out of the cooling system. Now, one of the reasons why you want to bleed air out is if um, your car never gets to its normal operating temperature or if it idles and it's kind of rough, the RPM never, it fluctuates and that's pretty common for a Honda for, with air in the cooling system. Or third one would be if you uh, just recently replaced the uh, coolant. And so what you want to do first is you want to make sure that um, to remove the air out and you have the new coolant in already, you want to check the uh, reservoir. Make sure like you have more uh, than the full mark in your uh, reservoir. Because what's going to happen is all the air is going to come out and it's going to be replaced with the coolant. Um, next thing you want to know is that you want to leave the uh, radiator cap um, just loosely on here because um, you're probably going to have to add more um, coolant later. What we want to do now is we're going to start the car. Now this is for a, uh, the car we're working on is a 2014 Honda Accord. So. For this one, we're going to set the uh, heater on high on both sides here and we'll set the fan on low. Um, some people want, they set the fan on max also, but for me, I just set it on low. Um, what we're going to do is now we're going to wait for the radiator fan to cycle twice, which means the radiator fan should turn on at least twice. That should take roughly about 10 to 20 minutes. So here we're going to wait for the fan, the radiator fan here to turn on twice. Once it turns on twice, um, you know you're done. But we're going to leave the radiator cap off and uh, sometimes coolant might overflow, which is fine, you'll just clean it off. And that's the second cycle. So now you can shut off the car. So now if the coolant is low on in the radiator right here, uh, just fill, top it off right there. And the uh, reservoir should still have like a lot of uh, coolant. So you will just close, top off the fluid and close the radiator cap. What's going to happen is once you do one uh, drive, when you drive the car around, um, the reservoir should uh, go a little bit lower. So you should come back to normal. So after you drive one time, check your uh, level on the reservoir and that is pretty much it thanks for watching